Fred Oppert. Frederick Barry Oppert, 25 May 1939 9, August 2016, known as Fred, was an American racing driver, car dealer, and founder and owner of the Fred Oppert Racing Team. As a driver, Oppert's race entries included the 24 Hours of Daytona and the 12 Hours of Sebring. His team, Fred Oppert Racing, fielded many notable Formula One drivers early in their careers, including future Formula One world champions Keek Rosberg, Alan Jones, and Elaine Prost, as well as future IndyCar champion Bobby Rattle. Racing career Oppert raced sports cars and single seater Formula cars until 1970. He raced in Austin Healey Sprite, a Jaguar X 150S Elva Couriers, Porsche 911s, Chevron Sports Cars, Brabham Formula Cars. He won the U.S. Northeastern Championship in 1966 and the SCCA Northeastern Division Championship in 1969 driving Brabham's ABT-21 and ABT-29 and entered 1969's inaugural IMSA event at Pocono. He also raced in long-distance races, including the Daytona 24-hour and Sebring 12-hour in 1965, 66, 67, and 68. Fred Oppert Racing Formula Atlantic slash Pacific slash Mondial and Formula 2. Oppert imported British sports and racing cars into the USA from the early 60s until 1978. The models he imported included the Elva Courier, Brabham, Chevron Titan, Tui, and Tiga. Oppert ran a turnkey racing business where drivers could buy or rent racing cars from him and have them prepared and transported to race meetings by his mechanics. He also ran professional drivers for whom he could attract sponsorship or who brought sponsorship with them. The New York Times wrote that Oppert indicated that the primary reason he began fielding teams was to sell the race cars he imported Chevron, Titan, Supernova, and Brabham, but that now in 1978 Oppert said he was in it just because of the racing. Over 14 years, many future Formula One drivers, including Alan Jones, Elaine Prost, 228 Bobby Rattle, Jack Lafite, Didier Pirani, Jean Pierre Gerrier, Hector Ribak, Rolf Stommelin. Patrick Tambay, Peter Gethin, Tom Price, and Rupert Keegan all drove for Fred Oppert Racing. Keek Rosberg was the driver whose name is most often linked with Oppert, as the American funded the Finns racing in Formula Pacific, Formula Atlantic, and Formula 2. Fred Oppert Racing competed in the USA, Canada, Argentina, Colombia, Venezuela, Mexico, New Zealand, Japan, Macau, and many European countries. The Argentinian races were F2 Temporada in 1978, where Oppert ran Rosberg in a Chevron B42. Fred Oppert Racing School Oppert established one of the USA first motor racing schools in 1971. The school was at Bridgie Hampton, and the first instructor was New Zealand racing driver Bert Hawthorne. An advertorial for the school appeared in the New York Magazine on 10 April 1972, four days before Hawthorne was killed racing at Hockenheim. Mexican Freddy Van Buren took over after Hawthorne's death. The school moved to Pocono in 1973, when the Bridgie Hampton track was sold to property developers. After the school moved, an advertorial appeared in the June 1973 edition of Popular Mechanics. When Van Buren returned to Mexico, Swedish driver Bertel Ruse became the chief instructor and eventually took over the school and rebranded it under his own name. Formula One With the demise of Chevron racing cars after the 1978 death of its founder Derek Bennett, 228 Oppert gave up running his own teams and took on the role of team manager with the ATS Formula One team, a notorious job according to Motorsport magazine with the highest turnover in motorsport. Oppert soon became one of many casualties at ATS, resigning after the 1979 French Grand Prix following team owner Gunter Schmid's decision to pull the ATS car from the race. Return to Team Ownership Oppert returned briefly and tragically to team ownership in 1983, 
when he put together a Formula Atlantic team for his friend Olivier Chandon de Brailles. Chandon was killed when he was testing an Opert Rolt Formula Atlantic car at Moroso Motorsports Park, now Palm Beach International Raceway in Florida, preparing for the W Car Formula Atlantic Mondial Championship that would start in April. Later years, Opert turned his back on motorsport after the 1983 death of Shandon in one of his cars. Later in his life, he took an active interest in Nico Rosberg's career, attending phone races to follow Rosberg's fortunes. He died not long after attending the Hungarian Grand Prix, then visiting Germany, but missing 2016 German Grand Prix because he was too ill. Later that year, Nico Rosberg won the world championship title.